yes, I'm in the car. It's Monday morning. I'm waiting for Mark. Uh, unfortunately, he's sick today. And I'm outside the doctor's office because he did not want me to go in with him. I think he may have the flu. Oh, there's a little girl who just came out with a face mask on. That's so sad. She probably has the flu too. I heard it's going around big time. So Mark started getting sick on, um, let's see, Friday night. He woke up with his really like scratchy type, you know, dry throat. And then uh, yesterday he really took a turn. It got pretty bad. Um, he had a little bit of a temperature. And today I found the thermometer. <laughs> Since you don't have little kids anymore, <clears throat> you hardly ever need a thermometer. So I had to really dig for it. But I think he had a hundred degree temperature, which isn't crazy. But um, I believe the older you get, uh, any little temperature is worse than a little kid having like 104 or whatever so we, we decided that he should go to the doctor plus if it's the flu he's going to need a doctor's note uh, for work because if you miss any more than two, day, two days in a row for sick days um, you got to have a doctor's note to back it up so that's why we're here. So I'm waiting for him to get his diagnosis. I'm pretty sure it's the flu. Um, I don't think it's a cold. But it would be nice news if it was just a cold. But it's it's probably going to be the flu. I just hope I don't get sick. <laughs> I don't want to get the flu. I have too much work to do. And um, Sean was complaining this morning that he said no more sick. I'm not completely sure if he wasn't feeling well or not, but he didn't have a temperature or anything, so he went to program. But um, I totally wouldn't be surprised if he got sick. <sighs> it just, when it rains, it pours, you know? If it's not one thing, it's something else. But hopefully, um, hopefully we caught the if it's the flu, I hope we caught it early enough for him to at least take like Tamiflu or something because I, I feel like that probably would help him uh, recover quicker. So we'll see what the verdict is when he comes out. Oh, and we're back. Oh. But Daddy has turned into Maddie. <gasps> That's weird. I know, right? <laughs> so, um, yes, I dropped Mark off at home and picked up Maddie so we can go shopping. So mm -hmm. Mark does not have the flu. That's good news. That's very good news. And I believe they are calling it bronchitis. Okay. <laughs> it has a name and its name is bronchitis. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I guess he's going to be home until Friday. What? Really? Mm-hmm. Wow. Yeah. That's crazy. I mean, in a good way, right? Yeah, no, I'm excited that he's home, but I hope he's not going to be, like, sick, sick all those days. Well, I'm, I don't know what medicine they prescribed. They said he, he has to stay home till Friday? They didn't say he has to. They said he could. Oh. So, he can go back to work on Friday. Uh-huh. So. Wow. That's nice, right? Yeah. And, um, I hope uh, we can run through the stores now because it is quite late. Yeah, it's like past 1230. Yeah, so. <laughs> you know what? A little shopping is better than no shopping. True. Plus, there's things that I have to get. So, it's not just like we're, we're going joy shopping. No, this is like we need food. <laughs> yeah. Although, don't let me buy a lot of stuff for the fridge because there's just not room. Okay. But after we eat all that asparagus tonight, there'll be more room. Mm -hmm. in that way, but I don't think we need lettuce or anything like well, that. Well, I wanted another salad kit. Well, yeah, you can have oh, a salad okay. kit, but don't <laughs> let me buy a giant, you know, vat okay. of lettuce. And obviously we need mushrooms and stuff. And All right. Yeah, so, because I, I can't live without my mushrooms. <laughs> I just can't. All right, well, we'll let you uh, I'll show enjoy everybody. that. Yeah. So, that was an incredibly, incredibly long afternoon. We just got back from errands and um, yeah, 
It's a gorgeous day out, but um, I've spent almost the entire day in the car. <laughs> almost the entire day. So we didn't really get very much. Hi, were you waiting for me? Were you waiting? Were you? Oh, mini wags. All right, so this is what we did get today. I'm going to start with this over here, this buffalo cauliflower. This is uh, by the Tattooed Chef. Uh, they've had this line at Sam's Club within the last year, I suppose. All different um, vegan things. Uh, I think over the holidays we got some sweet potato thing. And there was also a zucchini zoodles uh, nest thing. So I do like this brand. I'm excited to give it a try. Oh, I wonder, does it come with the sauce, too? Oh, yes, in a spicy buffalo sauce. Or is that the spicy buffalo sauce? And they don't, I don't know. It'd be nice if that sauce came with it, though. <laughs> right? I, it would be really nice. Um, I also got some chickpeas, some peppers. I've been trying not to buy junk food, so I think I succeeded today in not buying any junk food at all. Because I don't consider uh, cauliflower junk food, even though it's got a, a coating on it. I don't think it's bad for you. Um, Maddie got a little makeup uh, bag. I got some um, cotton rounds with the exfoliating thing on it. Some plain hummus. Some mushrooms. Some salad. Some anjou pears. Some pink lady apples. Some broccoli. The off the eaten path. Uh, chips, some plain blue corn chips, organic of course, and uh, a case of the um, this drink that we tried the last time that was really good. It's an organic, um, I think it's like a flavored coconut water. Um, it's pretty good. I think it only has like 20 calories for the bottle. It comes in two flavors. It comes in mango, clementine, and cucumber, watermelon. And it's pretty good. It's pretty hydrating. It tastes pretty good. I mean, it's not my favorite. It's no buy. <laughs> but um, I, really I really liked it. I enjoyed it. So I got it again. Because that's what you do when you like something, right? You, you buy it again. <laughs> now I'm going to go face down into my lunch because I'm starving. It's almost 3.30. What do you think, Bowie? Were you a good boy? Did you take care of your daddy? Did you take care of your daddy? He's not commenting. Was he a good boy? Yeah. He was? Okay, good. Dinner time, Bobby. He said, I already ate. Babes. Hi. Vinny. Oh, he's got his little wrestler doll. Oh. He just had risky business time. Yes, he did. Oh, do you feel better? I just realized that we forgot to talk about um, Parasite the other night. We said we were watching it, but then we didn't say what we thought of it. So what would you think of it? It was so good. We knew it would be, though. Yeah. So I good. loved it. I thought it was phenomenal. Wow, what's all this then? All right, so let me take you through. We've got some chickpea pasta with mm. a little bit of... Um, Broccoli? Broccoli. Well, there's a lot of broccoli. Garlic? Um, I don't know if there's any garlic on there. We got some Dom de Louise on there. We got a little wow. olive oil on there. We got a little uh, vegan um, Parmesan. Parmesan on there. Then over here, we have the um, cauliflower uh, buffalo tidbits. I didn't put the whole seasoning packet. I put like a third of it on because I didn't want it to be too hot. Yeah. Thank you. And then over here we have some paisana sauce with some gnocchi and some hot Italian um, Beyond Meat sausage in there. too much goodness all at once. I know, right? If you want salad with it too, it's available. I... <laughs> well, we did have big salads for lunch. Yes. So, I also had big other food for lunch. Yeah, we had big lunches today because uh, we ate late and uh, we, were hungry. we were very hungry. 
Bowie, what are you doing? I am not gonna be able to finish all this, but I will try. All right, well, Sean's available to uh, yeah. <laughs> to finish your food if you if you don't finish it. Yes, don't give him seconds right away. No, let's see what you think. What am I trying first? Um, whatever. All right, let's see the cauliflower. Now remember, you can have more sauce if you want. I just didn't want to make it too hot, and I didn't taste it, so. Mmm, that's tasty. Yeah. All right, Tattooed Chef. That's nice. And yeah, we've really been enjoying Tattooed Chef. Yeah, they have some good uh, good combos. That's a nice flavor on that. On the um, Tattooed Chef? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mmm, yucky. Yeah, we haven't had gnocchi in a while. No, we haven't. Probably not since which the holidays. Isn't, which isn't gluten free, but I'm gonna have a little bit. I'm just gonna have a little. <laughs> Why do you do this to yourself? Uh, I don't know, because I just want to be a little normal sometimes. Mm. The pasta is really good too. Oh, well, thank you. It's creamy. Yeah, I figured it would be. I like that. Alright then, well, I hope you enjoy your you potpourri too. of uh, goodness. Oh, it looks like it's NFTC time. Notes from the couch. Hello. Hello. What's up? Not much. Upgrades. Oh my goodness. I'm not used to seeing you with that. Upgrade soul. Oh, that looks creepy. Novel, which is really good. Wow, you're almost halfway through it. Yeah, I mean, it goes pretty quickly. Because it's pictures. <laughs> <laughs> the story's really good, though. I highly recommend this. Okay, it's called Upgrade, Upgrade soul. soul. Yes. Um, Did you sell your soul? Not yet. Well, that's why you haven't made it. I know. <laughs> um, so we're about to eat breakfast and watch Project One Way. Yeah, and uh, Mark is feeling better. That's good. A little, very little. He did get some rest last night, which is nice. I think he sweated it out a lot. Oh, really? FYI, they tried to give him this freaking poison ass medicine, and he was like, "Um, I don't want to die, so I don't want to take this because." Unbeknownst to us and him, his te his actual temperature, not on our Jenksy thermometer, was 103. Whoa. So if I had known that, <sighs> I would have been like, you're going. But we have to get a new thermometer because ours sucks. It's probably like, I don't know, 15 years old, like a electronic one. I feel like there were a lot of times in the last few years when some of us may have had fevers and... It didn't register didn't on the it. thermometer? <laughs> yeah. Well, maybe that was from Kristen overusing the thermometer and maybe. messing it up. I don't know. Yeah. Kristen would take her temperature like every hour. <laughs> a little bit of a hypochondriac at times. Yes. But anyway, uh, we got him a different medi- I hear him coughing now. We got him a different medication and uh, it's not going to hopefully kill him. <laughs> not. So, um... He started taking that yesterday, and I think he's um, improving a little bit. So I think rest is probably, rest and fluids are probably the best thing that you could do when you're sick. Unless you don't need rest or fluids. <laughs> I don't know. For what he has, though, he just needs to rest a lot. So, Bowie. Hello. Oh. He had the biggest smile when I came back from dropping off Sean today. It was so nice to see. Um, we're gonna go. We gotta go. So thank you. We appreciate you. And until next time, much love.